Good morning, you lot. It is, let me tell you what time it is. It is 10 to 6 in the morning here in the UK. So I just got up, well, got up about half an hour ago. A little bit late today, but I thought I'd do a quick live workout for you. So good morning, Facebook people. Good morning, YouTube. I hope you're well. In this video, I've got a 10 minute workout. We're going to do a 10 minute early morning workout for the early morning crew of you out there. So if you're watching this, live say hello say hi good morning or good evening good afternoon wherever you are and if you're watching the replay stick a hashtag replay down below so i know that you've seen this video you're on it and you're going to do this workout with me that's the plan right so maybe you'll do it with me now facebook's comments have been at pants recently so they don't come up as soon as they should and sometimes not at all so if you are saying hello then i appreciate it but i'm going to go over here get to the workout I'm going to get stuck in Oh, so Maggie's in. Hey Maggie, good to see you. Hope you're well. And uh, where are you? Let me know where you're from. So anyone who's watching this live, let me know where you're from. We're going to get cracking in a minute. I've got 10 minute workout, five different exercises. Okay, nothing too crazy. I'm going to throw in lots of different options for you just in case you can't do the high impact exercises. Okay, so hopefully you'll be able to get through this with me. And even if you can't do it now, make sure you come back and watch the replay and do it because it's going to be a good workout. Good way to start your day, get you moving, get the blood flowing, get ready for action, okay? Now, as you can see, it's getting dark here in the UK. It's very dark outside, so it's definitely coming into that part of the year where you want to stay in bed that little bit longer. But I'm up, I'm here, I'm ready for you. So come and join me with this one. Let's see how we get on. So our first exercise is stance jacks. Stance jacks look like this. So if you start with your feet together, and you're just going to hop and drop to the side and back up. Switch your hand around, hop and drop. From the side, it looks like this. Now, if this is a little bit too high impact for you, and then you can do the step version. So the step version, I always have to try and get my mind ready for this one. Step out to the side, reach down, step back to the middle, reach. And then you can speed it up. So there's always something you can do that's a little bit less impact. And as your fitness progresses, then you start to bring in the more bouncy version, okay? So that's our first exercise. If you're ready for this, whether you're watching live or whether you're on the replay, come and do it. So Maggie, hopefully you're gonna get involved with me on this one. So let's see how we get on. Remember, say hello, like and share, share this love. Get it out there. Friends, family, random people in the street, let them know, hit that like button, share it, and we'll reach a few more people out there. So let's do this. 50 seconds work, 10 seconds rest, 10 minutes. That is all we're doing, just 10 minutes. Ready for it? Let's go. All right, here we go, stance jacks. I've got to be a little bit quiet actually this morning because the girls are still in bed. So I don't want to wake them up. And halfway through this workout, we have Gracie, my six-year-old, come in with blurry eyes. I go, Daddy, what are you doing? So I've got to be a little bit quiet today. Now, stance jacks, you're here with me. Show me from the side, because I want to make sure your back is in good shape. That little curve in the small of the back, but I'm not rounding the back, not going into a hunchback. We're here, sticking the butt out so it's not a squat. Knees are bent, but I'm not going down here. Now let's keep it moving. So far, so good. Exercise one, done. All right, next up, got a cheeky one for you. Squat and kick. Who else have we got in here? Enid. Hey Enid, great to see you. I don't think I've seen you on here before. All right, the squat and kick, we come down, bang, bang. Now with your squat, feet a little bit wider than shoulder width, get your butt down low, come up tall, and kick. You can kick as high as you want, or as low as you want. Depends how flexible you are. And just launch that leg out in front, bang, bang, give it some, give it some welly. Again, from the side, watch that back position. Making sure you're not here. You're down low, up, kick. Again, as I said, give it some welly. But at the same time, you're going at your own pace. So you don't have to go a million miles an hour. Everyone's starting at different fitness levels. I'm gonna give it one more, bang. All right, next one. Now this is a cheeky one. It's called a one-two high knee. So you're gonna take two steps, Bring the inside knee across, and you can go as slow as you like. 
I do it super slow for you here. One, st two, knee. One, two, knee. One, two, knee. And that's all it is. And then once you get into the rhythm, speed it up, have a good time, and we're off. We're off to the races. Now I'm on my mat here. Kind of perfect guidance for this. But you can use your couch, your sofa, whatever you call it. In the UK, we call it sofa most of the time. Or settee is a new one for you if you're across the pond. Last few seconds here. All right, next up, we're gonna burn the thighs. We're gonna drop down into the squat position. So we're down here, and all we're going to do is bounce. So a little pulsing move. Now try and keep the weight on your heels. So I'm here, my head's up, shoulders back, chest proud. If at any point you feel your back going into a hunchback, stand tall, reset it, shoulders back, and go. So we're just bouncing, bouncing, bouncing. This is gonna burn a little bit, I'll be honest. It's going to burn, especially the second round. All right, keep it coming, keep it coming. Fight it. Grit, if your teeth bite the tongue, do what you can. Get through this, we have 10 more seconds. Ooh, yes, it's getting a little tasty now. Come on, keep going, keep going. Three, two, one. Good stuff, shake it out. Okay, from there, onto your back. So I'm gonna lie down. And we're gonna go with some flutter kicks. Now for flutter kicks, I want you to keep your head on the mat and hands under your butt acting as a bit of a shelf. And it's just this movement here. Now there is flutter kicks where you can come up, make it a little bit tougher. But for most people who haven't got a strong neck or haven't done any exercise for a long time, then this is good enough. And you can make it easier by taking your legs higher up. You can even bend your knees to a certain degree. Do a bit of a cycle. Once you get good enough, and then this is what we want. It's a small movement. It's working the core. Getting those abs fired up. And you should try and keep that lower back pushed down. If you feel it arching up, then take a breather for a second, then get back into it. All right, come on. Nearly there. And relax. All right, so we're going back to the beginning. If I can get my watch sorted, there we go. All right, are you ready? Stance jacks. Off we go. Hop and drop. Reaching down. Let's keep it going. See, keep going, keep going, don't stop, don't stop. Keep pushing it. So, still moving. Who else is jumping in here? Flutter kicks. Boom, so, yes. <laughs> it does burn, it does burn. <laughs> it's good to see I've got a few people on here because I haven't announced this live. I've just gone live. I wasn't even planning it. I'm gonna do my own workout and I'm still gonna do a little bit of stretching. Some uh, some work for my for my knees. Remember, if you can't do the jumping version, step, step. We're trying to pick up the pace now. Deep breaths. Squat and kick coming up. Squat and kick. Who was that? I said it was Enid. I <laughs> Enid again. All right, squat and kick. Get low. Bang. As I said, give it some welly. Get into this one. All right, I'm starting to feel warmer now. So, should be able to push it a little bit further. Come on, get low on that squat. Sink into it, onto your heels, get low, come up, and Kung Fu kick, bang. All right, we are nearly here. Into the next exercise, 10 seconds to go. So legs are starting to feel it now, especially after that 
well, after those pulsing squats. Good, relax. All right, so the one, two, knee. One, two, inside knee. One, two, get into the rhythm again. And here we go. So trying to bring your heart rate up. So I'm starting to breathe a little bit heavier now. Waking my body up. So as you can see, it's just a little stutter step. So I'm not doing a big step. It's that change of direction that zaps the legs. Come on, keep up now, keep pushing. Go, go, go. Nearly there. Woo. All right. And the fun is just about to begin. Pulsing squat. Go down low. And let's bounce. Now, if at any point you're struggling during this, Let's come up, give yourself three seconds, maximum, okay? Just three seconds, and then come back down again. All right, sometimes that's all we need for a mental break, rather than just throwing it in the towel and giving up completely. No, you come up, one, two, three, go. And you're back into it. And that can be the same for any exercise. That really help you push on. Let's keep going, keep going. Bounce, bounce, bounce. 10 seconds left. Oh yes, head up now. Do not look down to the ground, keep your head up. Shoulders back, chest proud. Finishing style. And up to the top, good stuff. Shake it out. All right, down to the mat. We have our last one. And it is the old flutter kicks. So let's bring them up, get hands under the butt for a shelf. It's gonna help push your lower back down. I'm gonna try and keep that lower back pushed in. Control the breathing. And again, same thing I just said with the squats. If you need to at any point, give yourself three seconds. Rest and go again. We haven't got long left though, so we don't need to rest, right? Let's keep it going. Whew. 15 seconds. Hold tight now. Keep that lower back pushed in. Go, go, go. Two, one. Woo wee. So there we go. That is 10 minutes. Job done. Now, if there are any exercises in that little routine and you think, you know what, I can't do that. Just sub it out. Doesn't mean you don't do the workout at all. You just adapt it slightly for you. Okay. I see Rachel's in here having a coffee and off to the gym. Good stuff, Rachel. You're on the ball. I like it. I'll be, I'll be checking in with you later on. So watch out for that. So if you're watching this, you enjoyed that workout. First off, hit that like button and then share it with your friends. Okay. And uh, if you haven't yet, say hello, um, hashtag replay. And I'm gonna have a little chilled out moment now, do some stretching, do a couple of uh, mobility drills for my knees, because so I get tendonitis, I should say tendonitis in my, my knees, and I've got basketball tomorrow, so I'm trying to work on that. So hope you have a good day. Um, check out some of my other videos on here, and I'll see you later, all right. Take care for now.